I just finished tearing out the subfloor and taking off these wheel well panels. It's pretty rotted around them. So now I just need to replace anything that's rotten, which is pretty much the outer floor where this connects to. So I'm gonna replace around the wheel wells and the outer board that goes all the way around the outside of the floor. These inner pieces are really solid. They did actually paint those with some sort of, I don't know if it's like a tar or what, but the oh, rest of the- wood. Yeah, the, these aren't, but the inner two are. The rest of these, uh, or the, the plywood that was on top, was, it didn't have any protectant on it whatsoever, and there's supposed to be a, a membrane on there normally, so. Yeah, just gonna replace the outer trim, any rock that's there, and then they can start to put it back together. It's super cold out today, so I am taking the grinder wheel to all the metal framing to take off any of the rust. The primary frame is made out of metal, but there are two uh, middle supports that are not right on the middle of the trailer that are actually true two by fours that support the floor as well. And then the outer trim of the bottom of the walls is wood that sits on that metal frame. So your subfloor is going to be exposed to the elements. How are you going to coat that? Yeah. So the plywood floor that I redid, um, I'm going to coat the bottom of that with the uh, rubber spray as well. So that way it's all protected. everyone so today we're going to install the linoleum flooring first things first i cut the flooring to roughly the same size as the floor plan of the trailer a little bit of overhang for room for air and i was going to originally just kind of cut around the wheel wells once i laid it out in there but it's kind of a tight fit so i definitely recommend getting pretty precise measurements for your wheel wells and cutting those out first i'm going to be sticking the linoleum down with a double-sided tape for vinyl floors and the linoleum flooring um, generally pretty good for smaller spaces like bathrooms and in this case the trailer. If you have a bigger area you definitely probably want to use more of a glue but this will do the job. I decided to go with the linoleum flooring versus like a snap and plank flooring or vinyl floor just because overall it's a little bit lighter, um, easier to install to, a lot quicker. Um, and I would decide to go with a, a bright floor, uh, kind of a white color just because it's a small space and overall make it feel bigger. Thanks for watching our video on flooring in the trailer. Stay tuned next week for our lighting system that we'll be running. And if you're interested in keeping your trailer dry inside, check out our previous video on doing repairs to the roof, the J-rails, etc. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Make sure to like this video if it was helpful and subscribe for more content. See you next time. super cold out today but I am your brain's frozen yeah <laughs> okay, everyone so today we're going to install the aluminum